It's a pleasure having you for this weather update. Daphne Kawasit and Samba is my name from Uganda National Meteorological Authority. Most parts of the country today had a sunny intervals with hazy conditions in most parts of Uganda. Though some areas in the afternoon had showers, especially the, the western part of Uganda. According to a report that received today, Jinja reported a 15.4 millimeters. Kotido had 18.4 millimeters. And then in Tebe, we had 7.6 millimeters. Bugenyanya, we had 1.2 millimeters. According to the satellite image over Africa, it shows that we're having a low pressure center over the coast of East Africa, taking away most of the moist winds that would have come towards our country, leading to the reduction of rainfall that we are having. And also the hazy conditions are because of the winds that are coming from the north of Africa towards our country. For tomorrow, we are expecting sunny intervals and hazy conditions to prevail in most parts of our country, apart from some few areas around the lake, where we are expecting isolated thunder showers. Later in the afternoon, we are expecting showers in the western sector of the country, but then in the eastern part of Uganda, we are expecting a mixture of sun and cloudy conditions. Temperatures expected to rise to 30 degrees Celsius in the northern sector of our country, but then other parts of Uganda, we are expecting temperatures to rise to 28, though some areas like Kampala will we expect 26 degrees Celsius in Masaka, 27 degrees Celsius, and then in Kabale we're expecting 24 degrees Celsius in Kasese, 29 degrees Celsius. Going beyond Uganda, we're expecting Mombasa to have showers with temperatures rising to 32 degrees Celsius. Sunny intervals are expected in Dubai. Cloudy conditions are expected in Paris and also in London, and then sunny conditions are expected in New York. Though it's really cold in New York because temperatures are expected to rise to 12 degrees Celsius. Thanks for tuning in to UBC. Have a blessed evening.